Life is too short for matching socks. Thursday the 9th of April and it is time to let the job hunting commence. Now I have decided to be a little formulaic in my hunt so I will be applying for a minimum of five jobs a day and uh, then when those five jobs are done then I can take some time to uh, pursue my other interests and um, get outside. We've got some lovely weather at the moment so I don't want to miss out on that and uh, do all the things that will help me to stave off uh, any sort of anxiety or depression uh, which I am kind of prone to. So um, here goes, five jobs coming up and uh, the employment agencies that I'm registered with are getting uh, bi-daily phone calls so that they don't forget that I'm here and looking for work. Um, I've found another uh, extras agency to apply to so I should be doing that today as well. So uh, here's hoping. Hey guys, so I just got this email which is supposedly from PayPal. Um, I am positive that it is a phishing email. Um, I'm sure most of you know how to spot these but just in case you don't, um, what throws me first is the notice of a limited account. Um, if, if PayPal were to send me such an email it would probably be worded slightly differently so uh, it'd probably be notification of limited account something like that um the big giveaway here is it says dear paypal member now whenever paypal sends me an email they address me by my name um so that is blatantly someone who is just trying to gain access to my login details um the other thing is that if i scroll down here Look, there is a link here. Click here to remove your limitation. Now, never ever click on a link that you think may be phishing because it will take you to what looks like a genuine website and is in fact somewhere which will store your password and your username and then they can use it themselves. Now, if you look down here in the corner that's the URL that you go to now you can see there that is absolutely nothing relating to PayPal so uh, I think we can quite safely say that that is fake and let's stick that in the spam folder there we go Oh, jobs by email. That's more like the sort of thing that I want to receive today. Okay, so I've accidentally found myself at a former place of employment and I am doing a little workshop. Uh, we are making beaded and sequined uh, fabric bookmarks. Uh, so, uh, where's mine? I'm going to turn the camera around. Actually. There you go, that's mine. Phantom related, of course. So, uh, say hello, everybody. Hello, everybody. Hey. Yeah, that's mine. Well, that's yours, but I need it. <laughs> you can pay me three pounds for it if you'd like. No, it's right. You can get your free drink included. So, uh, this is my afternoon activity. It's good fun. You should try this. Um, I will, the, uh, the, the lady in, in black is the lady who's running the workshop. I will link to her um, Etsy page in the comment section below. Do go and check her out. She makes amazing corsets, among other things. And uh, I'll be back. Guys, good news, I've got a job interview. Uh, it's tomorrow, um, but it's in an area of the town that I don't particularly know. So I am taking this opportunity. I'm gonna hop on a bus 
and uh, go and find this place and then tomorrow I'm going to know where I'm going. Uh, it's uh, a receptionist position at a vet's. Um, I've never worked with animals before, I've never even owned one, but I do kind of like them. So uh, I guess I'll just have to see how it goes and of course I will update you in tomorrow's vlog to let you know how I get on. Um, so I'm going to go check this place out and then when I come back, I'm going to come back into town I think and I am going to um, see if I can get a new suit because my current suit is slightly too small for me. So uh, yeah, that's, that's my next move. So it is the end of the day and I'm happy to say that I did find a suit of all places I found it in Primark. Um, it is grey and it is the same material as the dress you just saw. Um, the dress did not suit me at all. I cannot wear those pencil dresses because, um, because I'm short and fat and uh, it just makes my belly look huge. Um, but I managed to, to find a suit, uh, a jacket and trousers. Um, I've got a lovely blouse that I'm going to wear with it. Um, I'm going to braid my hair back and uh, just accessorise with some earrings and a necklace. I um, took the bus to uh, the area where the vet's surgery is. Um, the bus didn't go sort of all the way past the parade of shops where it's located um but i do now know where those shops are it's a longer journey than i thought it was going to be um it's probably going to take me a good 20 minutes on the bus um but i imagine that uh if i do get a position there i can find a route that's quicker for me uh, on my bicycle and uh, we will just have to wait and see how things go tomorrow but um, I'll try and make a good impression and um, even if I don't get offered a job it's all experience and I shall remember this time to ask for some feedback on my interview and the interview technique um, so wish me luck and I will see you tomorrow so uh, for now sorry it's another short vlog but uh, sweet dreams <laughs>